to our glory globe tv viewers breaking news yes the central government has informed the delhi high court that the supreme court in yemen on november 13 had dismissed the appeal of malayali nurse nimisha priya against a death sentence imposed on her for murdering a yemeni national the final decision now lies with the president of yemen the government told the high court on thursday the court was hearing a writ petition filed by the mother of nimisha priya seeking permission to travel to yemen to negotiate with the victim's family by paying blood money the delhi high court asked the center to take a decision within a week on a request to travel to yemen from the mother nimisha priya has been convicted of murdering tota talal adbo mahadi who died in july 2017 after she injected him with sedatives in order to get her passport from his possession it was stated that nimisha priya injected talal adbo mahadi with sedatives so that she could take her passport from him while he was unconscious however he died of an overdose priya's mother moved the delhi high court earlier this year seeking permissions to travel to yemen in spite of a travel ban for indian nationals and negotiate the blood money to save her daughter blood money refers to the compensation paid by an offender or his skin to the family of the victim priya and her colleagues hanan a yemeni national reportedly chopped mahadi's body before disposing of it in a water tank priya was awarded capital punishment in 2018 hanan was sentenced to life imprisonment a mother of an 8 year old child priya worked in aman sanan since 2011 on thursday the center's lawyer said according to a notification issued recently the travel ban may be relaxed and indian nationals may be allowed to travel to yemen for specific reasons and duration the petitioner represent Tit by lawyer Subhas Chandra Kiar had told the court earlier that the only way to save a daughter from the gallows was to negotiate with the deceased family by paying blood money, and for which she has to travel to Yemen. But due to the travel ban, she is unable to go there. The Sep Nimisha Priya International Action Council approached the High Court last year seeking a direction to the center to facilitate diplomatic interventions as well as negotiation with the family of the victim on behalf of Nimisha Priya to save her life by paying blood money in accordance with the law of the land in a time bounded manner. The High Court had earlier refused to direct the center to negotiate the payment of blood money to save the woman but asked it to pursue the legal remedies against the conviction in yemen in the earlier petition it was alleged that mahadi had forged documents to show that he was married to priya and had subjected her to abuse and torture bendazi vote glory globe tv delhi bharat